Hello my dear students in this uh, episode let us uh, study about phosphate solubilizing bacteria phosphate solubilizing bacteria are one of the important bacteria which recycle or mobilize phosphate in ecosystem or in the environment so that it can be utilized by plants phosphate is one of the essential component for to increase plant growth hence these bacteria play a very major role in order to provide phosphate to the plants so how are these phosphate solubilized or mobilized by bacteria from the soil as i told you earlier phosphate solubilizing bacteria are abundantly present in the soil especially in rhizospheric soil and they perform their activity the phosphate present in the soil is reported to be in insoluble or either unusable either insoluble or unusable form hence in order to make this phosph phosphate into soluble and usable form there are different mechanism which is involved the first mechanism is immobilization immobilization is nothing but the phosphate is immobilized with xyz carrier molecule and it is used by plants let us see how this immobilization occurs some of the basic forms of phosphate in soil are tricalcium phosphate dicalcium phosphate rock phosphate rock phosphate and this these forms are unusable form hence in order to make it usable phosphate solubilizing bacteria are capable of secreting organic acids and other metabolites organic acid and other metabolites now let us see what happens once this organic acid and other secondary metabolites are produced or secreted they try to convert this tricalcium phosphate into phosphate ions this phosphate ion is nothing but phosphate anions and these phosphate anions 
are highly reactive in nature they go and bind or get immobilized with other ions like calcium iron magnesium etc so they get attach or immobilize to this ions and these ions carry them to the plants so this is how the immobilization process takes place by phosphate solubilizing bacteria which secretes secondary metalloblites and organic acids now let us see the other mechanism when it comes to phosphate solubilizing bacteria there are different types of bacteria for example pseudomonas ervinia rhizobium bacillus etc so these bacteria are abundantly these bacteria are abundantly found in soil what they, what they do is <clears throat> especially these two bacteria are capable of secreting gluconic acid and this gluconic acid and also capable of secreting malonic acid so this gluconic and malonic acids converts the insoluble phosphate into soluble form which can be utilized by plants whereas rhizobium and bacillus species are capable of secreting two keto gluconic acid this acid is capable of converting phosphate immobilized phosphate into solubilized phosphate which can be utilized by plants so this is an overview of the mechanism how phosphate is utilized by plants by phosphate solubilizing bacteria so now let us see how to isolate this bacteria from the soil the first and foremost method is the first and foremost method here is soil sample is collected which is which undergoes serial dilution and the serial dilution sample is subjected to serial dilution and here it undergoes plating technique wherein different dilutions are plated on to the media the media here used is a enrichment or a specialized media which is called as pikovsky media pikovsky media which allows only soft phosphate solubilizing bacteria to grow what happens after the incubation if this is the petri plate you can see different colonies growing along with this you can see the colonies with 
clear zone of inhibition and this represent that this is phosphate solubilizing bacteria and then this phosphate solubilizing bacteria is subjected to pure culture technique and from here pure culture technique it is cultured at large scale after inoculating it in large scale it is centrifuge and the biomass is used as biofertilizer so this is how the isolation of phosphate solubilizing bacteria is done with this let me give you an overview of the importance of phosphate solubilizing bacteria phosphate solubilizing bacteria is used as biofertilizer the reason behind it it converts the insoluble phosphate to soluble or usable useful form which can be used by plants these phosphate solubilizing bacteria are capable of cycling the nutrients in ecosystem and supports the growth of plants and other microorganisms hence it is one of the essential it is one of the essential forms of they are one of the essential forms of microorganism which are having economic importance they also maintain soil fertility so these were some of the benefits of phosphate solubilizing bacteria and the biofertilizers available in the market of phosphate solubilizing bacteria contains live a viable form of culture which is mixed with carrier molecule carrier molecule such as coco peat coal ash etc so this has this is the overview of phosphate solubilizing bacteria and its importance see you in my next class with much more information on agriculture related microorganisms